Hey folks, it's me again, Andreas here with the second part of the bread. You remember we put the dough here from the ciabatta. So the table is the rest flour from the other bread before I make always a bunch of breads, so three, four breads. So, wow, look at this, ridiculous. Hey, look, you hear that? You, wow. That's also the sound you should have afterwards from the, from, ah. When you uh, have the bread finish, it should sound like hello, like this. Here we need a little bit flour also. We have it from the first round of the normal bread. Come out, come on. Oh, wow, nothing so much left over here in the bowl. It's cool, perfect. You can see also olive. Hey, <laughs> get out. You see, the Italian people, they fold it like this and this. And that's why you have later when you uh, buy it, it looks, it looks like this, all right? Actually, we can do the same. But what we need is something to put on. Okay. So we keep, need to keep some stuff. Oh, it gets full. I have the baking tray and it still has from last time some, uh, uh, what you call it, baking paper. So and since you make this for your home, you don't need to throw it. You can just make a second use of it. So I will done now, look, you can see if it's good or not. It's stretchable. That means the gluten in the dough work already. All right. So we make two of this. That's a little bit smaller, bigger. Take a little bit more. You see how it is sticky? Oh my God, it's full of gluten. They develop. Because when you start it, the dough, yeah, it's flour. We need any way to put spring flour later. It was a small accident, never mind. I roll it a little bit so you have it later look like this. You need a little bit more. We need it anyway because it's the face I like to have the same uh, ciabatta, uh, the face of the sprinkled flour. Yeah, that looks eh. And now we put it over to the tray and do the second one. Back, we do this again. And this is finished. You know what I do? I take my homemade wine. So, 
Now we have done this one. We will cover it with the clothes and wait another one to two hours. See you later. Uh, we will bake it also mm, the same as a normal bread with 180, 200 degrees, 25 minutes, something 20 minutes. We will check it. We can control it. When we want it more dark, we push it more up. Uh, not the temperature, the, the high, the level of the uh, ciabatta. And when it's finished, you will see how it sounds to check when the bread is good. It sounds different from the normal bread, but uh, you will see and I see you in part three, all right?